name is Gustavo Barderas. I'm proud superintendent of Eugene School District 4J, in Eugene, Oregon. 17,500 kids, 32 campuses, and uh, recently honored as a National Superintendent of the Year for 2020 by AASA. So I'm really excited about that. In my personal background, I come from a migrant family that uh, uh, was raised in a small town in Nyssa, Oregon, which is a border town with, with Idaho, and a product, proud product of Oregon public school systems. Uh, my personal story and what I see when I walk into classrooms is kids that aren't used to seeing role models that look like them. And that's something where I've tried to promote over the years, over time. So in my current district, 39% of my principals are principals of color. And that was done very intentionally. It's, you know, kids need to see a reflection of themselves in leaders, but also at all levels of the organization and principals and teachers. And our goal is to continue, continue to work toward, toward a systematic improvement of our system to have intentionality in our recruitment and retention efforts for all our, our staff. But intentionality is reflective of what the kids look like. We need to be proportionate. Equity is an often overused term lately. And to me, equity means intentionality and providing access, opportunity, and inclusion for all kids. And that's removing barriers and developing systems to remove those barriers for having more kids be able to take advanced placement courses, whether IB or AP, but intentionality and using data to drive that. So sometimes uh, equity, if it gets in the, in the in the way of adults, it's sometimes stymied. So by using data to help inform all decision makings takes away the argument to why we're doing what we're doing. It's just what's doing best for kids. Being very kid focused, student centered. I get up every morning with kids as my in the middle of the bullseye. Kids are always in my decision making matrix right in the middle. Because if I'm doing what's best for kids each and every day, I'd be assured that I'm doing what's best for the adults that are working with those kids but having equity to be able to have systems in place with their interventions, which well, starts with a viable curriculum, but having systems to support kids, such as AVID, to support kids throughout uh, the K-12 system and the alignment of that, I think that's what's gonna make a difference for systems. And it's seen, we've seen that in Eugene, the last six years, our graduation rates have improved by 14%, but we've also closed the opportunity gaps. So kids in special programs, their graduation rates have improved by 23% the last six years. Latino kids, 19%. And kids navigating poverty, 19%. Because of the systems we have in place. So the system doesn't fight me so much anymore because they see success and they own it. So now the teachers own it. The school campuses own it and the community owns it. You know, what, what drives me every day is really that I have 17,000 kids under my charge and 3,000 staff members that work so hard each and every day in my community but there's kids that look like me in classrooms. I was them. I was a Spanish speaker that stuttered badly in our public school systems growing up in elementary school. But it was the public school system that empowered me to be successful. So my goal is to empower our kids, all our kids, regardless of what they look like, from navigating poverty to breaking barriers. There should be no first in any outcome. There shouldn't be the first Latino superintendent to ever win this national award, Mexican-American uh, superintendent to win this award. We gotta break down those barriers. So to me, I serve as a role model for my kids, for my community, but more importantly, I serve because I am passionate about kids and what they can do. But I wish every kid would have the opportunity to go through AVID. AVID is just a great system for all kids. From the note-taking opportunity to the public speaking, it's just something that I would recommend that every school district really take, take a look at and really implement.